Filtration is a method to separate a solid from a liquid. Ensure you know whether it is the solid or the liquid filtrate that is the product you wish to collect. This is the equipment we will be using for performing our Buchner filtration. Set up the Buchner flask by clamping it securely at the neck. Assemble the vacuum pump correctly. Wet the ends of the hose with water and twist to connect the end of the short hose to the cold tap. The long hose to the side arm of the flask and the plastic exit piece should drain into the sink. Use a rubber seal between the Buchner flask and the funnel to provide a good vacuum. Place the filter paper in the funnel and dampen with a few drops of solvent to form a good seal. Turn on the water tap and press the funnel down lightly to ensure that suction is there. This is usually obvious by watching the filter paper which should flatten out and may dry. Swirl or stir the flask of your impure compound. Pour the content slowly down the glass rod onto the filter paper. Pour at a rate that allows the filtrate to collect in the flask and not in the Buchner funnel. Continue to swirl and pour the entire contents onto the funnel. Use minimum rinsings of cold solvent as necessary to ensure that all the contents of the conical flask are transferred to the Buchner funnel. Check that the filtrate is clear. Continue to vacuum until the solid is dry. Remove the hose from the Buchner flask to prevent suck back and then turn the water off at the tap. Carefully transfer the solid to the pre-weighed watch glass or specimen vessel. This can be easily done by gently lifting the filter paper with the solid and placing it upside down on the watch glass, peel away the filter paper. Check the filter funnel to ensure that the entire product has been collected. If required, place in a warm oven to dry before calculating your percentage yield and obtaining the melting point. Alternatively, collect your filtrate if this is your desired product.